Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mob. We're back over to area the Epic Mod Pack Season 2, live streaming twitch.tv slash Mr. Mobby. Sorry, slash Mob vs. Games. New channel. If you follow the old one, go to the new one. So we're here live, ready to go. The chat is here on the side, not showing it on screen. We got a good amount of people here from the channel. Thank you all for being here. Um, even though you are watching the uh, thanks for base following, even though you're watching the episode live recorded here. I expect you guys to be on on the channel and still comment something so let's go ahead and get started um, I have something set up for this particular episode we are going to craft a couple of things first of all um, we are gonna craft well let's just go straight to the demon altar and I'll show you the uh, thank you Fred ruler for fallen the nearest altar is going to be well it's kind of far off actually the only ones are over here Hey, CDR legend is her following Let's go, let's go. Doot, doot, doot. Uh, let's just run, pretty run. So, our character does look different, but that's only because I turned off the extra add-ons from my um, accessories here. Kiwi Andale, thanks for following, look at this. Took it off, mm. Hey guys, thanks for being here. Woo! All right, so like I said, I did update the, the prefixes, so some enemies are still much more difficult to fight than others. XX Biol, thanks for following, man. Welcome to the stream. Say something in chat. Love to see, love to have you here. Now let's go. What's this thing do? Calm, reduced enemy aggression. So that's part of our armor set. That's pretty actually. That's actually pretty crazy. Five percent increase all damage, life regeneration. I don't even know how much extra life regeneration we have, but it's nice. There we go. Glad to see everyone here. We're already getting a lemonade. Alright, but you guys should be pretty excited because I'm uh, trying to find a new boss. Um, hopefully we can fight it as soon as the next day pops up. Um, I'm also headed to the Demon Altar to craft another item to initiate the Blood Moon. Instead of waiting for it, I need to initiate a Blood Moon. Not only do I want to fight in there to get a little more different types of souls, but there is a certain item that the Dryad sells only during Blood Moon. And that's the Vicious Powder. Oh no, the Vile Powder. And I want that. I really want that. How do, you, how do you get lemonade again? You get lemonade by using uh, lemonade you get from trees. It's a pretty simple. You just craft it. It's pretty awesome. Is it the Omega weapon? No, it's not the Omega weapon. Don't, don't, don't drop that again. What's up, Bully the Troller? Guys, he's a troller. Oh my god. What's up, Jack Cloud? How are you? You use lemon. Yeah, yeah, damn right you use lemon. What if boss gives an invincible prefix? Well then... Uh, I, I would hope uh, there was some way to kill it. I missed a life fruit. Hey, hey, hey. All right, let's go down here. Let's go. Which one do I need to go down? So we're going to go down here and just go to one of the demon altars here. Um, the only thing we want. Are you feel an evil presence watching you? That's perfect. I wanted to fight that thing. Oh, my God. We are about to fight the eyeball here. That's perfect. Hell, yeah. Oh, ooh, do I coca? Thanks for following. Woo! Appreciate it, bro. Alright. Oh, yes. We're gonna fight the eyeballs, guys. But I wanted to craft the item really quick. The item I was gonna craft before anything happens here. Oh, no. No, not the under. Over here. Um, we should be able to fight the eyeball, right? No, I have Cthulhu. Um, if we were able to kill the worm with no problem, this should be easy. It's only one entity. So we just have to hope he doesn't have a crazy prefix on him. I swear to God, if any boss ever has the like exploding prefix or the, the magic fireball one, we're, we're just dead. We're just fudged. Beyond belief. Um, Maui, if it was Moon Lord and had invincibility, it would last so hard. Well, I hope they don't have it. All right, let's craft this thing and get home. All right, so here we go. I'm crafting the Blood Moon Medallion, five vials, eight arcade, and some silver bars. Makes it so we can have Blood Moon. I'm guessing we'll wait till the next night, though. So let's make that. And we're going to make the Grand Flare Gun. Summons the Grand Thunderbird. Only usable during the day. So we'll wait tomorrow morning to do it. Anything else we can craft here? We can make a Suspicious of the Canine. Make another one. So just in case we fail, we can make craft one right here. Mana Crystals, etc. All right. Let's Magic Mirror home. Wait for this boss. I have Cthulhu. It's Pyrophobic. This guy's on fire. All right, anyway, let's do this. I'm ready to fight this guy. All right, me and you, buddy. Let's try to stay as far away as we can. This guy, um, arguably a little bit easier than the wall. No, not the wall. Than the um, the Eater of Worlds. 
but he is pyrophobic, so I'm giving him a little taste of his own medicine. A little bit of fire for yourself, huh, you butt face? All right, so our armor, it's a, it's, you know, it's a little weaker. Like, one defense weaker, but in the increased life regen and all that should make this boss easy peasy. Lemon squeeze. Oh, wait, he is one entity, but he keeps fighting the little babies out here. Oh, my God. Look, it's pyrophobic. He's dropping all that stuff everywhere. Everything hurts, guys. Everything hurts. All right. Got the, what the... Oh, my God. There's fire all over the floor? That's not good. That's not good. All right, you... Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Oh, God. There we go. If I can just get a couple of swipes soon with my Arcalis, we should be good. Yeah... All right, we're good. We're Gucci. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Jesus, stop with that. We're getting a lot of soaring energy. Um, hopefully, we we could probably farm solar um soaring energy from this boss in the future. All right, that's some very loud noises you're making there, eyeball. I think we have enough time to fight two eyeballs in this night time, so we'll probably do it. Just kick his ass. Stop doing you what you're doing there. It's not gonna work out for either of us if we gotta be this way. Oh, he's so loud. Got him. The Eye of Cthulhu has been defeated. Now I gotta sadly gotta dig down a little bit to grab the goods. And we'll cover it up and we will fight another boss right now. We'll fight the same one, actually. So let's um let's get rid of some stuff here. Uh what do I gotta get rid of? Weeds, purple iris, little tulip. And before I open up the treasure bag, let's fight another one right away. So we're pretty much fighting the twins. and Yeah, we're fighting the twins. You got that right. All right. Uh, there we go. This is going to be interesting. I'm just glad we're not fighting them at the same time. So we're getting a bunch of soaring energy here. Hmm. Now, I, I may be off, but I'm pretty sure soaring energy had the ability to give us some early game wings before we even hit hard mode. Now, that'd be awesome if that was the case. Look at that, I'm chopping him up! He's just standing there, like an eyeball. Yeah, look at my life regen, it's so good! What's up, zombie pool? Thanks for being here. Thanks for everyone for being here. Okay. I'm just gonna take it, let's go. Actually, no, I probably shouldn't sit there and take it. Where'd he go? Ah! Eat my apple pie! Eat my apple pie! Just put it in the bottom of the jukebox, baby! I eat apple pie! Um, come on. I got him. I totally got him. I totally got him. Come here. Come on. Got him. Woo, we got boss energy. Boss energy. Which one is that? This yellow one. Boss energy. All right, well, it's night time. You know what? We still have time. That sounded horrible. We still have some night. So this is what I wanted to do. I wanted to purchase some vial powders. So I'm going to purchase 99 of these. Actually, let's get um, more than that. So this is all I wanted right here. I guess we should get some corrupt seeds, though. Like 30 of them. Okay, so that's what I wanted. That's all I wanted. Now we're here. Bag of potential consumable. What can be inside can be used at the extractinator. That's pretty interesting. Jesus. All right, anyway. We're getting a lot of bag of potentials. What's going on here? Jesus. All right, anyway, we can get more phantom souls. This is gonna be interesting. So we're gonna fight for the rest of this night, and uh, it shouldn't take that long. Okay, I need to start quick stacking some stuff here. I'm running out of room. Is another giant patchwork zombie, you know. Actually, the game is really loud. I'm gonna turn it down just very slightly. I don't know why it's so loud. Hey, there you go. Turning it down. Blah, blah. Blood Moon Badge. Got it, got it, got it. Jesus. Alright, there you go. Ah, I actually turned it, turned it back up a little bit. It was real loud. Okay, this is gonna be it. So, is this guy always gonna be here now, Nabib? Yeah, it looks like he lives here now. We still have one extra room left. As soon as one more embassy pops up, we know we're gonna have to spend a little time to make a little more. Alright. Melted Invar, Severed Hands. A lot of crazy enemies here, but... We can we can pretty much handle it. So I can't wait to open all this good stuff. We don't have an extractinator yet We have to actually just find one underneath. I might be able to craft one Because you know our mod pack and all that, but yeah bag of potential pretty good uh, Because we killed a, a new vanilla boss. Well, not like a I say new to this world 
but we killed him. Hey, Shadow, welcome to the stream, buddy. More Phantom Souls. Bionic Orc Warriors. So many different enemies during the um, Crimson. Sorry, during the Blood Moon. It's pretty sweet. It's always nice to see new things. New enemies, Invar shields, etc. Oh my god. Woo! See you guys for uh, the, the people who are leaving later. Alright. Guess what? Did I, what hit me? This armored eye diamon soaring energy. I still need to look at what the heck that does. How long have I been playing this world? A good amount of time. I don't know. I don't know the specific answer for that. I mean, if you watch the series, you kind of know already, right? All right, so we are gonna fight this guy during the next day. It's two in the middle, but yeah, with the vile powder, I wanted to make vicious powder. We can vice versa it. Uh, what's up, Ghost Killer? Actually, I hope I don't need like the Tinkerer's workbench to do it. If I do need the Tinkerer's workbench, then well, at least I've created it in advance. Oh my god, this guy. Stop it. I'm gonna talk to my guide here. Alright, buddy. I ay ay. What do I need for that? I'm about to be attacked. Get off me! What's up, alternate? How's it going? Woo! Alright. Let's go ahead and see what we can do with this vile powder here. So a demon altar, I need a uh, Ron chunks. No, I don't need the Ron chunks. Hold on, hold on, I'm about to be attacked again. I need to make the vicious powder. Tinkerer's workshop! Crap, so I, I can't do any of the vice versa type of deals until I get a Tinkerer's Workshop. So, yeah, I won't be able to fight the Brain of Cthulhu just yet. But when I do actually have the chance to fight him, he'll pretty much die easy. Because we, we, we would have found much more harder bosses by then. But of course, we want to do, we want to fight every single boss. So, um, all our NPCs will unlock new gear. So, wait until the Blood Moon's over. Wait a minute, do any other NPCs sell anything new during the Blood Moon? We gotta look. We gotta look. Alright, you! Geralt! He sells the Toxic Razor Knife, Twilight Horns, blah 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 blah. Alright, you chirpy. Alright, Blood Moon's over. Look at that snow shotgun! Excuse me? A snow shotgun and a candy bow. 20 range damage, that's way better than my crossbow. That's pretty cool. Candy bow! Huh? Ah. Alright, you, nothing new. We will check out all these guys. I guess even the painter. You, you know, Richard. Um, Unholy Arrows, Quiver. He, okay, he sells a Quiver now. 20% chance to not consume ammo. One defense. Catapoopy. Catapoopy. Alright, Harry, what do you got? Bloomstone, Lightning Tomb, nothing new. Nothing new. Alfred. Also nothing. An angler, screw the angler. All right, what do you got? So yeah, after every time we kill a new boss, we have to look through this. Kitchen knife, spoon, and forks. A spud. This is ammo. Excuse me? Becomes mash when it hits an enemy or tile. Because it's a potato? Oh my god. Spud bomber. Uses spuds as ammunition. Um, interesting. It's kind of cool. All right, Deshaun, what's he got? We got a tungsten bullet. Wow. Sells tung tungsten bullets. And Umarel sells a Durian. Carry some range damage. Um, just checking anything new. One more NPC, two more NPCs. You, morning, new things. No, Death Wheat, Blink Root with you, George. Nothing new. Okay, cool. Now let's uh, get ready to fight the other boss, which is the giant bird arena. Uh, we have, well, we gotta open up these treasure bags, right? We got some demonite ores. We got some unholy energy. Um, Shield of Cthulhu's, which uh, gives us two defense. It's also a material. I'm not sure what the material is going to be. So let's go ahead and see what happens. It turns into the Obsidian Shield of Cthulhu. Uh, this is a modded item, correct? Check this out. 30 damage allows the uh, player to dash. So it pretty much combines just the shield. That's pretty freaking cool. Alright, so it looks like we only need to hold on to one. We'll sell the other one. Put everything else away. This is pretty sweet. Alright, so yeah, the vile air, the vile powder, even though I got it, just can't do anything with it yet. I wanted to hold it off so we could fight the brain. But we have to wait. Vile power does not go there. Demonite ore goes here. And we we pretty much Gucci. Um, let's see, vile powder. More of that. Unholy arrows can, I guess, 
go here somewhere. Uh, wooden arrows go away. You go away. We have bag of potential consumable. Only usable as an extractinator. Can't do anything with it. Uh, I don't think I want to switch anything out. This is only two defense. But it gives us uh, four percent. No, no. Uh, well, we'll we'll leave it here. We need to finish our wall of swag later. So let's empty our inventory a little bit. I'm ready to fight this boss. All right. So uh, yes, it's mod unless I miss an update. Now it, it should be just the mod thing. All right, guys. If you're watching on YouTube, I'm gonna end the episode. If you enjoyed, leave a like. It helps so much. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. Upload a lot of daily videos. We got a new. I got a new NPC, the blacksmith. Excuse me. I got a blacksmith. And uh, we fought uh, pretty much the twins. I mean, give or take, we fought the twins. The the Blood Moon twins, so thanks for watching. <laughs> Remember, our live streaming twitch.tv slash Mombi versus games. Come by and join in on the chat. There's a lot of like mess happening. Everyone's like talking about some random things. And I'll, I'll see you guys next time.